Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. In today's video, we'll be doing another Divine Masculine, Divine Feminine reading. If you do enjoy this video, please give it a thumbs up, leave a comment, and subscribe. Also, join membership if you'd like to. It is the link in the description box or the join button below the video. Uh, you can join for channel messages and extendeds. Uh, we will potentially post one for this reading. There is a lot of channeling, so likely we'll have to do that. Um, so yeah, we will be posting members. We just posted earlier today as well, some channel messages and also just um, another signed video. So yeah, we're gonna get into this reading and if you guys can't tell, I have two new card decks here and both I'm extremely excited about. So one of them is the 90s deck and this deck is the one I started using in members reads. Um, also, oh my god, Luca's licking my other cat, the new cat, Kita, and he's never done that before, at least that I've seen. Oh my god, they're being cute. Uh, I would have shown you guys, but they just walked away now. Oh, so cute. <laughs> Sorry. Wow, distraction. Anyways, um, okay. So, basically, these new cards in the 90s deck is so cute. Um, it's on Etsy if you guys want to buy it. Uh, I will put it in the description box below. She has discounts if you buy more than one. So, if you want to support her, definitely check it out. I love, love this deck if you like getting intuitive messages. Um, highly recommend it. And also, if you're just like a 90s kid like me. So, yeah, I would buy this deck. <laughs> Anyways, and then the other deck I have here, if you guys can tell, is my cards. I'm so excited to have these in person now. I've been waiting on them forever. Um, so I have another copy coming as well. But anyway, so these are my cards, guys. Uh, this is the Simple Oracle. It's actually the most popular one that I have on Etsy. So you guys can buy them if you'd like to. Um, this is what they look like up close and personal. They are poker size cards with rounded edges. The corners will not be perfectly round because he uses um, just like a, I forget what he calls it, like a rounder for the corners. It's a smaller business as well that I'm ordering from now um, for these to come faster. So they're going to be at my house so I can just ship them to you guys. But like, look at how cute they are. I'm obsessed with them. They're like the perfect size for shuffling. They're exactly how I imagine them. They are thinner material, if that's okay with you guys, but they're still good quality. Like, honestly, I'm obsessed with them so much. Like, I know this is my own Oracle deck, but the fact that I can do readings with them and I get such accurate messages, like, I'm in love with this deck. I really hope you guys check it out. Like, of all the decks I've made, definitely check this one out. I've also made a hot and cold version of this deck now, um, which is more, like, I guess, like, more in-depth, more Twin flamesy. but I really like this one for just, like, overall every sort of reading. It's so useful, and, like, look how many cards you get. You get 108 cards in the deck. It's huge. Um, yeah, so anyways, the only thing I will say is the corners, like, you might notice when you first get them, like, you can kind of tell they're freshly cut, but now that I've been shuffling them, it actually, they get even smoother. It's odd, like, they're so nice now, so I don't know, the more you shuffle them, it's, like, the better they get, but anyways, so they come, um, wrapped when you get them in plastic wrap. Uh, I don't have a box for them, so if you order it, make sure you order without a box so you don't pay the extra money because if you order with a box you have to wait like super long for the ship time and it comes from a different location if you'd like to order from this smaller company the card quality might not be quite as high as the other company but um honestly you get them faster and they're just as good in my opinion like i have no issue with these so yeah if you guys are interested please order it supports me and i like honestly i i feel like you'll love this deck if yeah, if you like my readings, you'll love this deck, so. Anyways, okay, <laughs> finally getting to the actual reading part. Um, I kept hearing before starting this reading, we have a lot to unpack here, so I feel like someone has, first off, a lot to say, but also I've been getting something quite literally about unpacking or packing. Um, I do see travel for the holidays for sure. Someone is traveling potentially overseas for the holidays, a long distance I keep hearing, or a long distance phone call, something about a FaceTime call even could be significant for you guys um I'm just gonna straight up say like someone here they're coming back like this person's coming um that's all I gotta say like I've never seen it so strong in the readings this person is coming back full speed ahead this person is like confident in it like they know what they're doing this is no person who's like on the fence now about doing this they're they're serious about this they want to do this um and they're determined and they're already been in the process of getting stuff ready and planning things and preparing for this and i am telling you this person is so impatient they're so they're like okay if they're working 
or doing other things like I see them looking at the calendar looking at the clock counting down the days to like their holiday or if some of them like work a nine-to-five job like they're looking at when they get yeah like when they get their next days off so they can travel or something but I also see something about them having to go to some other family event or they're supposed to be going to somewhere else like for some of you it is I keep getting stuff about Thanksgiving I've been hearing stuff about turkey dinner I keep hearing all these Christmas songs um this person could get invited or have to like they're supposed to be or expected to go to like some sort of family gathering or they do go to something for Thanksgiving like this could be I almost see like there could be something that goes down in Thanksgiving that's relevant to this whole situation and then like something about Christmas is really important like I just keep getting something has to happen before Christmas um okay so they go to this other family gathering whatever this is and I see once again family members finding out about what he's planned I also see him talking to friends about everything that he's planning to do for you because I see that whatever this is that he's been planning is going to take more people even or more people are going to be in on this than just him like I see other people involved in this situation here by the way I know it says courthouse legal matters this is actually referring to um like marriage guys uh yeah so that's significant there also could be though I'm getting a court situation going on for some of you here with an ex or something like there's something about an ex here I'm going to talk about that in a minute or someone who is jealous there's definitely a jealous person in this situation someone is super mad that you are going to be getting a lot from this person because it seems like this person guys is spending a lot of money on you whatever this is they are putting a lot on the line is what I'm hearing um yeah I don't know why I'm hearing trendy or trending right now but that's also coming out so basically this person is talking to friends about how much they feel for you at some like party or family gathering and I see their friends <laughs> making fun of them the friends like are you crazy are you sure you want to do this like oh my god we didn't know you were that into her like I'm seeing someone be like well, their friends are laughing at them because they're so obsessed with you like they're to the point where they they can't get you off their mind I know I've said this before but this is like a different level this is like someone who is just like I need to get to her I have to see her like we I have to make this happen like it has to be it's like they need to do this for this specific time. Like, there's something about the timing. I keep getting cards, guys, about divine timing. Um, by the way, that is a card in my deck. Um, anyways, but I keep seeing stuff about divine timing coming out in this reading. Like, a date is specific. Someone is counting down the days till they can do something. I also get, like, with this card here, I was getting this energy of, like, dude, like, are you sure you're gonna do this? Like, we'll have your back if you're gonna do it. But, like, really like are, are you are you okay like he's like yeah man like we gotta do this I gotta get there like I gotta make this flight I gotta get out on time um I don't know I'm hearing traveling back something about coming back or going back somewhere even or visiting family back home somewhere I don't know somewhere where they've been before but I see someone traveling and like rushing like they're like okay if I get this train then I can make it here by this time something about um I keep hearing first class tickets they're trying to make it to a flight on time or something I just see like something from a movie almost like a Christmas movie you know when they're like they gotta make it back home for the holidays and they're like almost like you know when um you just like they can't make it back on time like everything's going wrong like they're missing their flight or something they say there's no flights out they're like I'm gonna drive there then like I just see this person so determined and their friends are like okay well um you know if it means as much to you we'll support you but like we also think you're slightly insane <laughs> like it's something like that um this is what I'm getting it's a big deal. Also, do you see something about the movies? It's coming out again. Movies, popcorn. I keep seeing something about that. Um, also, with this card here, do you guys remember, like, all the readings? I've said it reminds me of Lion King, like, someone returning home. And, like, look at the card that's coming out. I'm telling you, someone is returning somewhere. Or, like, they're coming back to explain is what I was hearing. They're coming back to explain themselves and say, like... I don't know like they're gonna explain why like that something wasn't the way it seemed as well I keep hearing something was twisted or it seemed a certain way but they didn't want it to come out that way like they want to make something really clear I keep getting stuff about clarity see the glasses on him I don't know why there's a big focus on glasses right now 
Um, I kept looking over at my glasses. I don't wear glasses, but I have like 3D, 3D, oh my gosh. Maybe something about 3D glasses, movies, I don't know. But anyways, um, they're computer glasses, like blue light ones, but I don't know if they do anything. Anyways, so glasses, something about looking through the gla looking glass. I don't know, that makes me think of that movie Freaky Friday, The Looking Glass, the book she wrote, something about writing a book, a novel, publisher, I have no idea. We're going too far into this. Anyways, um, yeah, this person would be a little bit nerdy. They could wear glasses. Um, someone could have orange hair here or something about orange hair could be significant. Red hair, I don't know why that really stood out to me in this card. Um, something also about like concocting something, having a plan, like someone in a lab, they could be a scientist, they could be, I don't know, that makes me think of also like testing for something. Um, I was hearing clean bill of health in, in this reading, so something could be going well for someone if they have like an appointment or something like that. Um, again, please always, you know, use your own discretion with medical stuff. I'm not a medical doctor, cannot give medical advice. Anyways, but yeah, I get that this person something about them making something or preparing something or someone's very creative or they like mix things up like making something new i was hearing something about love potion like someone feels i kept hearing hypnotized by you um like i see this person just drooling like staring at you like this is you this is this person they feel like kind of like a nerd next to you <laughs> but i don't feel like they are i just feel like they think they are in your eyes or something like they feel like they're kind of this nerdy person um, but then they see you as like this supermodel, like, oh my god, amazing. I also kept hearing that song with this card where it's like, if you want to be my lover, gotta get with my friends. Um, yeah, first off, they could be talking to friends about you, like even your friends about you. They could be planning something behind your back or they show up somewhere where your friends are at. I don't know. But I get more so this person's talking to their friends about you, explaining everything, explaining their feelings for you. I was hearing a lot of sexual things for this card. Uh, let me tell you, someone's sexual energy for you is like insanely strong. Um, like you don't even want to know how, well, I'm sure some of you do, but... <laughs> I was hearing a lot of different things, um, trying to also, I keep hearing someone's trying to pace themselves, trying to hold back a bit, like they're trying not to come on too strong. I also heard trying to keep my mind out of the gutter. I also heard someone can't sleep because they're thinking about you. Also, in terms of names on the wall, I kept trying to figure out what the heck that's been meaning in this reading. Um, I do get that someone could be a little bit creepy and they could have a photo of you somewhere that they keep for themselves like on their wall or something um I have to be honest like I was getting something about that either that or I'm also getting a message kind of interesting about like someone having a vision board even or like manifesting this like they wrote down their name somewhere or you guys one of you wrote down your names together or something and then like it becomes like almost like a prophecy I'm hearing like it comes true or something like that or someone's shocked by that I don't know I keep seeing something about like, I don't know, your name's on the wall. I don't know why that's so important. Carving, wood, maybe, um, something like that. And then also I get with this card too, someone wants to make peace with you. Like they want to make things right with you. That's why, see, we have all the peace signs and things like that. But I also get too that um, you could be someone into meditation or, you know, spirituality, obviously. Um, we definitely get the, these cards up here. You're someone who, um, they see you as very peaceful. Like in the past, if you guys had issues, they see that you resolved it like in a calm manner or you're very calm about how things happened. Like they look at that and they find that really attractive about you. I'm hearing right now that they see that as like a quality for a future wife or mother. Like someone who's a very motherly energy, very kind, uh, understanding I'm hearing. Um... But yeah, see, this person's trying to be the same as well. They also, they just really want to make something right with you. I just keep hearing they have to make this right with you. Um, yeah, something going on with um, diet. You could be dieting, changing your diet, something like that going on with exercise. Someone here works out a lot. I keep hearing something about reps in the gym. I don't know, something like that keeps coming out. And then do you see, we have defined timing up there, seeing signs. So what I keep getting in this reading is really interesting, actually. Um... I kept seeing someone who felt like they were, this is divine feminine is what I'm getting, someone who felt like they were losing their mind, they felt like they just kept thinking this was going to happen, they kept praying for it, I see something about being strong in the past, like letting this person go, but you knew 
like deep down that this person was going to come back somehow or you knew something was not completely over it's like you did this because you let them go you know when they say you let it go if it comes back to you it's meant for you something like that i feel like that's what took strength for you and it's like you knew this and because you kept knowing this like you're going to be rewarded for that and i see it as like it's actually kind of funny in this reading it's like divine feminine getting angry at spirit and like the universe being like okay like i've done everything you keep saying it's gonna be now and it's not now like when is it happening or maybe this is you guys mad at me i'm not sure <laughs> but um i just see something about being very impatient or getting tired of it but then also at the same time being like okay i understand divine timing i'll keep waiting like it's like you kept going even though you were angry sometimes or got frustrated you just kept believing and because of that i see spirit being like okay we're going to reward you trust us it's coming now but like it's a surprise you don't get to know the exact timing like that is what i'm getting from them right now it's like it's almost like they're making a joke about it like it's like yeah we know like you've been stressing over this but don't worry like we got it all figured out you're gonna be surprised you're gonna be shocked like i don't know it's just kind of funny it's like if you've been worrying about this and not knowing if it's gonna happen it's like in this reading it's saying like divine timing is now divine timing is coming like they have a plan for you and you don't have to stress about it basically and i don't know they want to like it's almost like being like good job for hanging on this long like you did it is kind of what i'm getting i keep getting something about being rewarded for your beliefs or something like that um so yeah that's what i'm seeing and i also i wanted to go over some of the channel messages there's so many like there's really significant ones in this reading like quite emotional ones some of them um so yeah, I'm hearing something about rolling your eyes. Someone could have rolled their eyes in the past as well at um, something about a more serious connection or someone even rolled their eyes in the past if like you had spiritual beliefs or like you, I don't know, it's like they didn't believe you I'm getting or something about someone's friends thinking they're crazy, um, like either one of you for doing this or thinking this is going to work out and I see you kind of like showing it up like something is gonna work out i'm hearing blowing it up in their face i don't know something is going to work out though and you're gonna prove someone wrong basically is what i'm getting um i'm also hearing something about development um i'm hearing seeing something clearer now like i've been saying i keep hearing that song i can see clearly now the rain has gone yeah apple of my eye genesis i was hearing 1738 i'm like hey what's up hello um, and then so that song, I think it says, I work hard from a baby. Um, yeah, whoever this is, guys, this person's been working really hard to afford something, is what I've been hearing. Like, they've been working double, sh double shifts or double time, or they've been putting in hours because they really want to show off, is what I'm getting. <laughs> like, not in a bad way. Like, I see as their friends are like, oh my god, dude, this is so over the top. Like, you're really going to do all that? And he's like, yes. Um, I'm getting, so one of the cards I pulled, I wish I kept it out. It was the scene from uh, Aladdin where he like shows up on the magic carpet. He's looking like a sultan or whatever. Like that is the vibe that I'm getting for this reading. Someone is going to show up like and pull out all the stops to get you back. Basically, they want to do everything necessary, like more than necessary to get you back. They want to really show you how much they feel for you. And that's why everyone thinks they're going crazy. That's why they're spending a lot of money. And this is a huge risk for them financially is what I'm getting. Um, I also keep seeing something about a job or they want to help you financially. Like they want to pay for things for you. This is someone who really like wants to support you. And they want to make sure that you feel supported, protected as well, safe around them. Like no one can hurt you. Like they just want to be the rock for you like they want to be stable for you it's just what i keep hearing um yeah i'm also hearing come for dinner please save me a plate at dinner excuse courageous i keep hearing something about explosion i'm getting this more as sexually though so i have to point that out i also heard otherworldly i heard tried to run tried to scream but my head was underwater but in that song it also says as long as i no one can hurt you also that was really bad but um 
I just keep getting that there's something about a safe energy. Like when this person is with you, they feel safe, they feel comforted by you. Like I said, the whole motherly energy thing, like peaceful, calm. This is how they feel when they're with you. Um, they haven't felt that with this other person. If there's a third party, they don't feel that way with them. They feel stressed out around them. They feel like they always have to be on the top of their game. Like if they don't do certain things, this person won't feel the same way. It's kind of like that. Like they just feel with you. They don't need to be a certain way or act a certain way. Like, I don't know. It's almost, you just make them feel good being themselves. You know, like they're enough just the way they are. Kind of like that. I'm just seeing two people like hugging. I don't know. I just keep seeing that. So that's what I'm getting with that. And I also heard vocal cords, exhausted. Um, someone might be doing a lot of talking, singing. I don't know. Um, something about graffiti. I don't know why that keeps standing out to me. Uh, someone could do art or painting here. I was hearing vandalism as well, like trying to ruin something. Um, I do get, again, this like third party energy that is jealous, that doesn't want this to happen. But guys, in this reading, do you remember I kept saying you need to cancel the wedding? Someone wants you to cancel the wedding. Like, don't do it. Um, in this reading, I was hearing I'm not canceling the wedding. I also was hearing something else. I wish I could remember. I wrote it down. It's just, I don't know where the heck I wrote it, but this person is not canceling something like because of someone else. They're like, no, I'm not doing that. Someone is talking back. Like they are determined to do this and they're not going to let a third party stop them. I'm seeing they're winning something. Like something is going their favor. favor. If it's an argument, um, they're going to win it. If it's like a legal thing, they're going to win it. I don't know, whatever it is. It's like positive things are happening. We have the sun card too, right? So something's working out here. Um, by the way, I also get this weird message about the fact that, um, someone's like, how the heck did you know that? Like it says, I know what you did. Um, I see you knowing a lot about this person because of obviously like readings or just knowing that they were coming or something. They're like, wait, how'd you know that? How'd you know this was going to happen? Like, <laughs> someone's really shocked. I pulled cards a while back in another reading that said, how do you know all this information? Like, someone is just really surprised by something about this. They're like, wait, did, did you know that I did this? Like, I also see something about, like, their sexual feelings too. Like, you knew something. <laughs> I don't know. You just know a lot. And this person's like, it's freaking them out a little bit. They're like, okay, wait, what? Um, and then I also get to, like, some of you knew that this person... I don't know, had, had something about, again, like a pregnancy for some of you. Again, this is not for everyone. I just see something about like, um, you knew that someone had like gotten someone pregnant or you just had this feeling. I don't know. I see like something about intuition here, knowing something like before it happened. Or I also get something about, um, with this card, it makes me think of um, something in front of an audience, like happening right in front of an audience. Do you see the sun shining down? Spotlight. So I see if this person comes back and says something to you, it could be when you're around a group of other people or there's other people watching. I keep getting that. Like I've said in other readings, like there's other people watching or around when this happens. I get like public or you're at an event or a party or like we said, like New Year's or something. I just see a spotlight for you or this is how this person looks at you. I do see someone here could be like famous or you're in the spotlight online or like again you're just very popular something like that i don't know i just keep seeing someone in the spotlight um yeah we'll get more into that in a second about where i'm actually seeing this happen too um okay and then i was hearing seeing you as cool and hip like <laughs> seeing you as popular in the limelight like we just talked about hypnotized spicy sexy spicy uh attractive i also heard tryptophan again i'm hearing explosion tired eyes i heard a look into the future or the past peace spiritual dignity um something about your outwards appearance is just icing on the cake someone just feels like you're the full package they feel like you have the whole personality they're like dude like she has this and this and this like she's got everything in one person like rolled into one i've never seen that before <laughs> Like, I feel like you're just, like, this unicorn to this person. Um, I'm also hearing something about, I don't know, I keep hearing the song Jump Around, Jump, Jump, Jump Around. I don't know. A lot of energy, something about Energizer Bunny. I keep seeing someone is just, like, antsy. Like, they want to get this going. Like, they want to they wanna travel right now. Like, they just want to leave. They're like, I'm done. I'm bored. I want to leave. I want to see her. I'm going to talk to her. Like, they are just, like, so 
all over this. Like they just, that's all they can think about is what they want to do with you. Um, maybe other things. Uh, okay. And then also sharing broadcast station, ruining my reputation, software, software, sophomore, soft launch, speaking to friends, admiring you, just kidding, baby, making fun of you, trying to get you to stay longer, figuring out what's going on, pacing yourself back and forth, anthropology, rubbing it all in, can't sleep tonight, I don't know, and then I heard a knock on wood, I'm not really sure what that's about, it could be sexual, um, yeah, I'm also hearing something really weird about a bar of soap, but it just keeps coming out, guys, and I was getting something about locked up in prison, reaching for it, slowly picking it up, I don't know what that's about, but that's coming out, um, I also heard rock hard dick, I don't know what that's about, Hopefully you could hear that. Um, referring to this card too. Uh, yeah, sexual energy. And then I heard pacing yourself back and forth. Again, I heard reaching for the phone and then recoil. I want to reach under the covers and see your pretty fingers and toes. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know, guys. I heard not the same person anymore. I recognize your personal belongings. Something about wet wipes. Wood, again. I heard got someone pregnant. Not making love tonight. Saving it for another person. Keeping it tight. I kept um explosion once again i heard i want to rip off all your clothes and okay we're not gonna read the rest of this sentence it's too much for you two but anyways you get the idea this person is very attracted to you i also heard jersey shore style whatever that means um <laughs> something about new jersey maybe um i also heard someone say i need you to be more specific on what you want to, what you want me to do in the bedroom so maybe there's something about communication there i don't know i also heard loose necktie or moose that my phone auto corrected that i also heard sugar bear big enough to handle you i don't know okay documenting paid rent heard that as well okay i also was hearing something about for the king of cups something about hearsay i heard i keep hearing something about waking up waking up on a saturday night that song um on a saturday night could be new york maybe hollywood in my london paris maybe tokyo something's going on anywhere i go tonight tonight yeah tonight um and then it says in that song too people talk talk about me they know my name they think they know everything but they don't know anything about me yeah, and then I heard right after that with King of Swords over here, couldn't be further from the truth. This is a judge in this photo, so it could be something legal. Maybe there's gossip, rumors about someone, someone saying it's not true. Um, again, I see them winning if there's any situation involving like a court deal or something like that. Um, and then, yeah, at a family event, like again, I'm just seeing that there's going to be rumors about the fact that this person is going to be breaking up with another person is what I just keep hearing. Like if they're still with a third party, I see that could happen during the holidays where they end things with them or like Thanksgiving dinner or a family event. I just see like it's like the final straw. Um, I also see them talking to friends about this person and the fact that once again, this person could be toxic or abusive. I am seeing something about this person being very jealous about them, this masculine giving money to you or something or financially spending on you because they want him to just continue to support them financially. Like I do see this person as someone who relies on this masculine, like they need him for money basically, or something to do with a house or property, like to pay the bills. Um, and then, yeah, so I see they're very jealous about this and I see something about confronting him and whatever happens at this event, I don't know. They're going to break up, basically. And I see friends, like, see, we have the friends in this card. I actually see friends helping this masculine um, if, some, if someone starts a fight or they get toxic, like, at an event. Like, I see them telling him to go, like, they'll, they'll hold this person or they'll take this person. For some of you, this could get physical to the point where this person ends up getting arrested or something. They're going to do it to themselves, though. So yeah, not for everyone, but I do see that there will be some sort of argument with this third party and there's going to be an ending, basically. So if they're still with them, I see this ending very soon. I see a breakup and I also see this masculine blocking this person. Like on the phone, if they're still, like, I don't know, something about the phone number or they try and contact him through a different number, like he's not going to answer. Like he's blocking everything or ghosting this person, he's leaving. So yeah, that is going to be over with, whoever this third party is, unfortunately, and this third party is going to hear rumors before it happens, though, and that's why they're going to confront him. Something, again, about seeing a letter to you or a gift for you and getting jealous about whatever it is, basically, um, that is what I'm seeing. I really strongly get a letter, guys. Like, someone is 
written you something. Um, they were very emotional when they wrote this as well, I feel. Um, they think about it a lot, and uh, yeah, there's a gift involving... Oh, I was hearing things. Um, I'm getting something about Charlie and the Chocolate Factory, so it could be chocolates. Um, I think I told you guys... Okay, I'm hearing Plant Basket right now. The other day, I was hearing something about... Okay, I'm hearing... What the heck? Now I'm hearing so many things. Marble Slab. I'm also hearing Pitchfork. I don't know why. But um, I was getting something about... Okay, I'm hearing Creamery Ice Cream. I keep hearing that song, I'll Stop the World and Melt With You. So maybe there's something about ice cream that could be significant between you guys. Or you go for ice cream together. I'm hearing Tefanod. I don't know what these messages are all of a sudden. But anyways, okay... I'm trying to still think of what I'm thinking. Ugh, so many messages coming through. Okay, I'm here. Cranberry now. Cranberry pie. Um, picking you up. Picking the lock. Parking behind. Okay, whatever. Um, Sunday morning. Sunday. A Sunday? Like ice cream Sunday? Okay, I need to just chill. I just keep hearing messages all of a sudden, guys, about whatever this is. So apparently someone... I think someone just has a lot to say or a lot to give you, I'm hearing, or do for you. Um... I'm hearing Sunday morning after a Monday morning, but I see something about flowers. Like I was saying, I keep hearing Garden of Eden or something about Eden. Could be the name of a shop, maybe like a flower shop. Um, I'm hearing something about forecast and wedding. Clean bill of health again. Uh, anyways, we're going to move forward because I can't stop hearing messages related to whatever this is. So someone has written probably a lot for you. And again, we have next significant holidays. There could be something coming up around Thanksgiving or Christmas, guys. I really get Christmas because I keep hearing Christmas songs. But I was hearing something about turkey dinner in this reading as well. Um, okay, moving forward. After I heard couldn't be further from the truth, I heard I want to save your life. I'm going to make you feel like a new person. I keep hearing someone is a new person or they feel like a new person. They're different than they used to be. Hearing something about repetition, RuPaul's Drag Race keeps coming out. I don't know what that's about. I heard peeking through the window, waking up at night, getting a phone call, trying to stop you from hearing. Molly? Molly Bex? I don't know. I'll stop the world and melt with you. Lock the door. I'll be first in line. I keep hearing I'm going to be first in line somewhere or I'm going to be first somewhere or first class. Something about being first. It's almost, um, again, to do with this whole, like, I'm going to get there on time. I'm going to be there right in the morning. Something like that. Someone's going to be, like, I'm hearing fast, early. Anyways, um, I'm also hearing something about, yeah, warehouse. Something about coffee stuff. Watching The Lion King or Disney movies. Something about that. Um, something about waking up late at night. A piece of red fabric. Uh, you took my saving bonds with them, put them in your name. Something about savings account, savings. Um, Wikipedia, I heard you're not making sense anymore. Look through the documents. Ramona, reminder, first in line at the wedding. Someone give me an answer. Mr. Sandman, bring me a dream. Bring me, yeah, bring me a dream. That keeps coming through. I keep seeing that whatever a divine feminine is hoping for, like, that is what is coming. Um, it's literally like your dream is coming true. I feel like someone has wished for this for a long time. I'm also laying down, forgetting what happened, spending some time with me. New York will pay rent for a while. First in line to get somewhere quickly. Martha Stewart genealogy. Let's get together. Furlough. Um, also, heard I'll take a five minute flight. Make sure I get there in time. Taking the train, rushing. Has to get somewhere. Moving faster. Doesn't want to feel this way anymore. Someone's done waiting. I don't want to wait anymore. They're dumping, what? Dumping something. Done handling it like they're fine. They need to get somewhere. They need to go somewhere in time. They need to hurry up. They are flying out tomorrow right away, saving time, saving money, looking for flight tickets, flight number, recording the family wedding, something about window of oppor opportunity. I also heard space jacket, whatever that means. Heard I'll be counting down, counting down the days. Countdown can also be referring to once again, New Year's guys. Um, spending money. Something about Miami, Florida, I keep hearing, or Florida in general. Dangerous. I heard saved you a seat. Sentimental. Love box. Pictures of you. Croatia. Football star. Excited to see you. I'll never stop loving you. Paper bag. Two tickets to Miami. Yeah, I'm seeing. Okay. Yeah, I'm also hearing. Sorry. I'm, I'm going to lay it all on the line for you. I also heard, are we there yet? I'm not going to make it. I'm not going to make it. Are we there yet? Are you crazy? Do you really think this is a good idea? <laughs> I don't know. I feel like this is someone's friends again. But, okay, I see someone inviting you on, like, a trip somewhere. 
during the holidays like they're gonna ask you to go somewhere maybe with them i even get something about like a camping trip i'm hearing log cabin right now can can kansas wood can wood i don't know kenwood something about um like a fire and the woods like someone inviting you somewhere i keep seeing that vision of like being cozy next to a fire um i'm hearing holding your hand pillowcase pillowcase something rough like oh gosh okay anyways <laughs> seeing something in the woods like i just keep getting that something about a walk wire a pathway up to it um florence italy for framing you frame picture frame fart i don't know but yeah i'm getting something like that like a date someone wants to invite you somewhere and they could be talking to like other people about this okay but what i see though which is really weird is like something about family i'm picking up on and like you're at even like a holiday or christmas event with your family and like you're looking at like i get something about nostalgia like you're looking at old photos or talking about the past like with your family or this person is like talking to your mother or something or talking to your family members about your you as a child like i don't know why i get something about looking at childhood photos like oh yeah like i remember when that happened oh, she was like this or like they're making fun of you kind of like they're talking about you as a kid or something or telling stories about when you were a kid like i see something at a family gathering or there's other people around when this person randomly like shows up or something like i'm seeing them someone's like oh who's at the door and then it's like this person like maybe you're i don't know what this is like i see you could be at a family gathering and this person shows up but i almost see like someone's family members could even know that they're coming or my, someone might be in on this i don't know guys this is what i'm getting though and i see this person showing up like hi um so <laughs> like just shy i see someone so nervous but so excited to do this they like and then do you see like i see our families like oh who's this like they're all watching from the background they're shocked by this but then i feel like some of them knew this was coming like they're like oh yeah like who's this at the door but they already know <laughs> i don't know guys i just see someone's family members like he 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 <laughs> what is this i don't even know what energy i'm in right now i feel like my hand keeps shaking because i'm like hungry i don't know guys but okay i feel like someone knows like someone knew this was gonna happen or like they're in on it like look at these smiles they're so sneaky like they were planning this or something i don't know but i have to read you like what this card says as well there's so many good messages coming out in this reading um okay i'm also hearing something about stargazing by the way uh someone like taking you somewhere to like sit under their stars holding your hand i just keep getting that i heard reborn revitalized um awakening in the spotlight something something about kundalini awakening watching lots of people watching something about a father and son i heard dynamic duo someone could have a child heard the song um up 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 it's only going up from here something about that shania twain song makes me think of cowboy hats i don't know something with that again um in the country and then i heard because i'll do anything something about birth again a child unrecognizable the the one person i couldn't stop thinking about the one person i had to see again i need to see you one more time to make sure that we're we're not going to save a life without me. I don't know. Saving you from your mother. Taking you from your mother. Um, this can be referring to, once again, like a child. If there's a, someone who has a child with another person, I see like maybe they get full custody of the child or something because this person does something. I don't know. Anyways, or I don't know. Maybe you're at a family gathering and you're talking to your mother and this person shows up. I don't know. Uh, I heard I'll break down the door if I have to. I'm telling you, this person's like, I'm doing this like I'm making it happen like they're so so determined to do this whatever this is with you um I also heard someone here could have pets as well I heard write a passage I have to do this pick any card I heard pick a card pick any card I don't know what this is I heard I'll differentiate between the two I'll save up for another ring if I have to a random accusation a random thought because of you tried to make myself seem like more i have no idea what these messages are i heard raising the price prices raising price tag sold out items laughing about the way it all went down spending time with you pictures of your you memories 
Okay, and then I'm hearing someone even ask you to go on like an evening stroll or something or walk with you. Like, will you will you walk with me outside? Like, if you're at a, a gathering with a lot of people, I see them asking you to go outside because I see someone being like cold or putting on a jacket. They like, give you a jacket. I see like something about cold hands again. Like, I don't know. I see you guys walking together outside or something. Um, I heard I'm making myself proud speaking up about it. I heard I love your hair. Do you need a better picture for this? Our names are on the wall. Something nostalgic picture of you. Something they have of you on their wall. Again, yeah, weird. Uh, I don't know. <laughs> I heard people are making fun of him because he's doing so much. You're trying to be really over the top or he's trying or they think he's trying to be over top. Someone is just mad that it's not them though. So like, yeah, if someone's making fun of this masculine, I see like it's like a third party, but they're just jealous. Like if it's anyone making fun of you or this masculine it's because they're jealous of something that's happening for you guys basically um yeah and then i also heard our names are on the wall like we used to look at the i heard look at the weird paintings he put up on the wall uh love the sound of your voice your music i don't know i can't find the picture i sent her figuring out what to do spending money on something long distance relationship a family home, our names are on the wall, asking someone to go somewhere with them, camping outdoors, like I just said. I was hearing Rapunzel. I heard Dale Earnhardt Jr. facing the facts. Yolanda said um, something about um, long distance or a distance co distant, co oh my gosh, distant cousin or relative. Like I see, again, relatives or something are around. Like this is a family thing waking up to find out you've been selected as number okay as number one for something but then i heard as the number one prostitute in the nation you've been selected to create a project i don't know i don't know what that's about but maybe you win some sort of award or something you've been selected to create a project online where someone wants to hire you for making movies particularly one of their sisters i don't know something about making movies i keep hearing uh, i heard weird liking the photos um Okay, I don't know where we're at here. I'm hearing recording studio. Losing friends over this, I'm hearing. Someone could lose friends over something that they're doing. Uh, I heard something about a movie, ticket, popcorn. Fully invested in this. I'll call you later. A liability, Parkinson's, parking. Looking at old photos of you. Watching old videos or, or movies. Um, I also heard someone say, make sure he puts more on his face, rub it into his face. Maybe someone's putting like sunscreen on a little kid. I don't know. I heard love you to the day I die. I also heard I can't spend another week without you. Um, I also heard someone's making fun of you, trying to make you seem weird. Uh, there's other people in on this. Like I said, uh, something about campaign manager. I'll see you. I'll, s I'll let you see what I've been doing, recording videos, playing them back um something about yeah that <laughs> i heard um okay i heard when we get back together we'll take a photo together we'll make a movie together we'll shake it shake on this something about shaking on something making a deal um i heard you make me feel like a new person i'm hearing that song make me feel like a woman um i wanted to give okay i heard for this card. I wanted to give you this as a thank you for knowing that I was more than than I said I was. Something about long distance phone calls, rite of passage, trying to make it better, trying to make it right with you, meeting time, Switzerland, something about a voicemail. I heard who is it? Who's here? Like I keep seeing someone like knock at the door. Like a knock on wood, someone's knocking at the door, someone's like, Oh, who's here? Um someone at the door, they have flowers for you, I was hearing, pulling a I heard Something about pulling you out, hold out your arm, hold out your hand, blanket of snow, a letter in the mail. I heard Lorenzo, Lor Lorenzo, Lorenzen, I don't know. Wet wipes, weird trickling down your spine, back of the leg. I don't know what that's about. I heard, I heard, I thought I trained him better. <laughs> Maybe it's someone's pet. Um, I also heard holding hands, ripped off. I need to rip off the old band aid as in I need to get this done. I could trade it in for something better. I better believe it. So I'm also getting like, if someone gives you something like, yeah, I can get you something better if you don't like it. Like, don't worry, like I'll, I'll, I'll buy something else. Like this person's so, so sweet. Um, <laughs> I'm hearing, you'll believe it when you see it. Remember what I said, repeating the past. Um, I heard revealing you're my soulmate. I drift off to sleep thinking of you, pretending I'm not alone. I'll cancel the flight if you don't want to go. 
see i see someone inviting you on a trip and they're like if you don't want to go on this trip either like i'll, I'll just cancel it we, we don't have to go here we can go here instead like this person just wants to make you happy so badly is what i'm seeing um i also heard something about crumbling i heard um do you want to go on this trip with me something about a hike even or do you want to go on a walk with me a breath of fresh air or getting some fresh air I keep hearing dripping down your spine, dripping down your back. Someone could be sweating a lot when, when they're doing this. I heard hold out your hand, pleasant smell, reminds me of her. While you're here, I'll do better, I promise. Um, something about Rosa Parks, I heard nervous as well. Someone could be coming on a bus, maybe? Um, I heard someone, this person also knows that you're right um, about something that happened in the past. So I'm getting basically... Um, you knew like all along that this person was going to come back i just see someone so i wish i still had the card out but i had the little mermaid card and it said on that card um someday i'll be part of your world and she's like looking at the boat in the distance and i feel like that was you like you knew and i feel like this person knew that one day like you guys were going to be in each other's lives in a more meaningful way like you just knew somehow some way like there was a bigger reason for this meeting, the reason that you met each other, and when you guys separated, you're like, I don't think this is the end. So that that's really what I get here about like divine timing and everything too. Um, and then, yeah, I heard you knew they were gonna be significant in your life, that they played a role in your life that no one else ever would play. You knew something was special from the beginning. You would have, I heard someone say you would have, I would have stayed longer if I could have there's more to it than it seems um someone doesn't want you to get a twisted image of what they felt in the past because it wasn't completely true they always knew that some way they were going to come back to you um that they were going to see you again they just had a feeling like it wasn't over that you two were gonna talk again um i heard the song talk to your dad go pick out a white dress it's a love story baby just say yes Romeo, say me, I've been feeling so alone. I keep waiting for you, but you never come. Is this in my head? I don't know what to think. He knelt to the ground and pulled out a ring and said, Marry me, Juliet. You'll never have to be alone. I love you, and that's all I really know. Yeah, okay. Sorry, I had to sing it all because I love that message so much. I am seeing, like, again, one of, like you guys thought you're like is this all in my head i don't know if this is real and spirit's like it's real and i quite literally heard in this reading it's going to be real like i heard something about it being real i wish i have to find the exact message but i was hearing something like that guys um and the fact that this person i'm seeing them come back and like propose like i'm seeing them come back and propose um i know that sounds crazy but that's what's coming out in the reading and that is why this person's friends think they're insane because I see them being like, I'm going to marry this girl. I'm going to marry this guy. Like, I'm doing it. They're like, are, are you sure? They're, and he's like, yeah. Like, I still know. He's like, I've known all along. Like, I'm going to do this. It's like this person just, they don't even have to think twice about it. Like, they're just they're just going to do it. And I keep hearing, um, this was a member's channel message, but I heard dropping down on one knee. So, yeah, I've been hearing that for a few days now. Something like that. So, yeah, uh, this is legit, guys, I'm hearing. Um and i heard i remember the first time i saw you there's you were more than i ever imagined and then i heard listen baby ain't a mountain high ain't a valley low ain't a river wide enough baby if you need me call me no matter where you are yeah so no matter how far uh as in this person could have been at a really far distance from you too they could have showed up from like they could have come very far to get to you even is what i'm getting like see they were like, I'm making it no matter what. <laughs> um, they won't let anything stay in the way between you guys anymore is what I'm hearing with this message. Um, I also heard uh, something about this the part of the song in the Grace movie where they say, um, True love's foul. Um, and then it says, wonder what she's doing now. So something about also people being shocked by this is what i'm getting because you know when that song says tell me more tell me more like how much did he spend um i've seen people interested like they want to know they're like wait how much did you spend on her like how much is he doing for her like holy crap like people are just like amazed by this they're blown away that this is happening uh like his friends are your friends are that's just what i'm seeing it's like everyone around you is just in shock um 
And in that song, it also says, told her we'd still be friends. So if you guys agreed, I see like in the past having an agreement or just like deciding on something or someone's like, we'll just be friends. I see like it was never meant to be that way. Like you guys knew like it was going to be something else. And then I also was hearing turn back the clock again from that song. Turn back the clock, forget my sins. I just want to roll my sleeves up and start again. That song, I was telling members, it will not stop coming through. It's like all on repeat all the time. So uh, don't, someone's wanting to fix things with you. I'm hearing pushing back the clock as well. I heard I'll see you again. And I was hearing that song like, when I see you again, when I see you again. Like, someone knew. I keep saying, like, someone here knew they were seeing this person again. They were not letting go of that idea that they were going to come back together. Like, no matter how long or no matter how far apart you guys were, you just knew that you were going to come back together. Um, and someone was brave. I just keep hearing someone was brave to let this person go. Like, see, they were brave to release this person because they knew if you let something go and it comes back to you, that it's meant for you, right? Um, I heard they knew it wasn't over. You both knew it wasn't over. Um, it just wasn't the right time. I heard we can't be together right now, but, but you, we will soon. Um, and I heard, and this is referring to the past, by the way. I also heard I'll make you my bride and I heard I'll see you for real. Part of your world, that song. Um, I know that's a card. Like, I know the Little Mermaid card came out, but I quite literally kept hearing that song. Like, at one day I'll be part of your world. And I also heard resurrection and something about a place by the water. Like you guys could go to a place by the water together. Um, yeah. And then I also heard I'll never stop loving you. I heard I'm supposed to be somewhere else right now. So this person could show up to see you and be like they are supposed to be at some other family event. But they don't care. They left that event or like they left, I'm hearing like they could have left that event early or they just decided last minute. I get like there's a last minute decision here. Someone finally decides on something They're like, no, I'm going to go, I'm going to go here instead or I'm going to do this instead. And yeah, so they tell you like, yeah, I'm technically not supposed to be here right now, but like I wanted to be. Um, I'm also hearing wishing on a shooting star. Let me save you from this. I heard blown away by your performance, your freedom. I don't know. I heard afraid to make this right need someone to help you speak up courageous i also get like again they're nervous about this they could get once again help from friends who are just watching in the background their friends are like cheering this person on like you can do it <laughs> and then someone else here is like wait what what's happening and, like i feel like not everyone is in on this i don't know this person also could be in construction they could be building something i do get something about once again working on a house for you someone's saving up to be able to afford a house for you guys to live in or they want to once again provide for you in some way i just keep getting that um i also see you guys going on some sort of romantic date like this is like a getaway or something during the holidays or they invite you out somewhere like i'm really getting that um Okay, I heard show off, lights, camera, action as well. That came through so clear. I heard making a movie about you, and then I heard please don't go. Um, I also heard something came okay, back over here with the nine of swords. It says, are you afraid of the dark? This is talking about someone's fears or worries. Like, I see something. Um, I'm hearing coming to completion. I don't know. <laughs> this could be sexual once again, guys. I was getting sexual messages with this card. I was hearing something about take your shirt off. I don't know. But, and then also I keep hearing something about putting firewood on the fire or something about a fire of some sort, like a campfire. Um, but I was hearing other messages with this card, like someone's worries or fears are going to be sorted out, something someone's anxious about. Like this person's going to help you too, like if you're nervous about something or like financial things, like they want to help you and be there for you. Um, like I'm hearing the way you were for them even, like maybe just emotionally you were there for them. And they want to do the same for you. I'm hearing something about blocked by your mother taping videos of you. This could be someone too trying to stop you guys from being together. But like I said, it's not going to work. It's not going to work. Like this is done. Like I'm hearing it's done. Like it's divine timing. Like it's meant to happen the way it's supposed to happen. Like there's nothing this person, anyone else can do to wreck this now. Um, yeah, that's what I'm getting. I'm also hearing, are you keeping secrets about what's going on? Payback for what you did. See yeah something about paying back money even could be significant but i also get like someone is annoyed about whatever's happening for you guys they could even try to like because this is referring to tickets they could be trying to even burn like tickets that are for this person's flight or they could try and mess up this person's plans i'm hearing flight pattern for some reason um 
<clears throat> I'm also hearing Sailor. Sailor Moon. I don't know what that's about, but yeah. I don't know. I'm losing my voice now, guys. So you may be trying to block someone from speaking up. <clears throat> I keep hearing something about speaking up, too. Like, someone needs to speak up about something. I'm hearing something about a savings account very often. I heard when you bid on it, it's not working. Try again. It's taking forever. Something about trying to buy something online or trying to bid on something. It's not working. Or I don't know. There's issues with something like that. I also heard leap of faith and I heard hardening up too fast. I also heard taking forever. Something is taking forever. Someone's like annoyed. Like a masculine I get is annoyed by something they're trying to do. Like they're trying to purchase something like tickets or whatever. It's taking them forever. They're like, oh my God, it's taking too long. I'll just drive there instead. I need to get there. Like someone's getting frustrated maybe. I also heard pictures on my phone, new names and numbers that I don't know. That song, Good Life. And... Yeah, tickets, burning down the firewood, burning the ticket, something about a purse, personal belongings, taking off your shirt, walkway, bleachers, I'll pay for your service, I'll pay for something for you, something about red leather, red letter, or red leather, yellow leather, I think they came through in another reading, like the last one maybe, something about red though, something red fabric of some sort, I just keep getting, or a red letter, like a Christmas letter maybe, um, I also heard screaming at the top of your lungs, pick up the phone, called you on your new number, blocked your number. I'll be camping under the stars tonight to tell you what I want to say. I'll take a photo of you and never send, I'll, I took a photo of you and never sent it. I blocked the message. Something about also this person could have wrote you something and never sent it and they're now giving it to you, like a letter that's very emotional. Like they're finally giving you something or releasing something I'm hearing that they, it, I'm hearing something about taking uh, guts to release whatever this is um they couldn't do it before but they're gonna do it now like they're gonna be brave and do this um okay i'm also hearing something about ball bearings and yeast i don't know what that's about um your prisoner locked up like a prisoner in terms of this card too uh i just see like if someone tries something here they're gonna end up in jail like if someone tries to mess with this union like if this third party if someone tries to stop this or does something really awful they're just gonna go to prison like they're <laughs> I don't know, I just keep getting so blunt, like, they're just, they're not gonna be around for this, so it's gonna be fine, um, that's what I'm getting from Spirit, we're not gonna talk more about that, uh, I also hear coat hanger, blacklisted, chiffon handbag, carving out the wood for you, distant cousin, my mother is not making sense, she needs, I heard someone needs a new suit for the, for the, the event or the wedding, um, I heard I'll take your mom's purse for you tonight and give you a call tomorrow when I get it back, for some reason, they need your phone number is what I'm hearing. All different numbers. Hillary Clinton. I don't know what that's about. Her waking up in the morning to be more productive, substantial, wishing you never started in the first place, leasing out or renting out, formidable offer, crazy mother, dreaming about your future loophole, pulling you out. This could be like a contract, getting out of a contract. Safety net, return. I heard ROI, return on investment. Soft launch. I heard PBI. I don't know, something that came up for that was PBI construction in Pennsylvania, which is interesting because I've been talking about construction. Also, I've been getting, just in the past two days, something about Pennsylvania, so that was kind of weird. That came through, and then right after that, I was hearing courier package, something about the mail, and I keep hearing mail drop or mail room. Um, I'm hearing Georgia or George, that just keeps coming out too. And then I was hearing jealous person, a part of me wants to say something, but I don't want to get, I don't want to get in trouble. Yeah, this is referring to, like, a jealous person or, um, I don't know. I also get someone wants to say something in regards to finances. They're like, I want to say it, but I don't want to get in trouble if I say this. Or someone's going to be annoyed if I say this. I don't know what this is about. Um, I also heard turkey dinner. I heard while we're watching the movie, we can make some new Barbie dolls for the kids. I don't know, some new purses. I don't know what that's about. <laughs> It's hard to understand why would you make me feel more secluded starving yourself of oxygen 10 year game plan throwing darts uh this we had a family event um i'll start gofundme program ending something with someone during thanksgiving and the holidays like a breakup during i see like it's like a family dinner there's gonna be like a breakup something after or right after that or something like that I also heard, I'm not canceling the wedding. I know what you did. You took my stuff and put it in your friend's backpack. <laughs> so maybe someone knows. Like, they know someone took the tickets or they know someone tried to mess with them. They're like, yeah, no, give it back. And I'm not canceling this wedding because I'm doing this. That is what I'm getting with this energy. And then randomly at the end of this, I heard bombarded with questions about 
about your stuff. I heard a lot going on. Something about shelf life. And again, I heard a lot going on. So I don't know. This is what I'm getting, guys. Um, this is the main message here. There's so much. Uh, but yeah, I see someone's family members, like, showing them childhood photos of them. Maybe someone talks to someone's, like, family ahead of seeing them. Or they tell them they're going to show up somewhere. Like, I just feel like someone is in on this. Like, someone's friends or family members. I just... This card just makes me laugh so much. I also was hearing Prince of Bel-Air too. I forgot. I don't know if I said that. But like, look at the smile on his face. Like, this person is so ridiculously happy to see you is what I'm getting. Like, they're just like, I'm hearing cheesy. Like, they're just like, so... <laughs> I don't know why I'm laughing so much at these cards. Like, maybe something's funny. Or someone's just nervous. I just see them like, hee <laughs> hee. I don't know guys what is this energy I just see someone's just like maybe it's also you I feel like you're like mm -hmm, I knew this was gonna happen I knew it all along <laughs> okay I'm gonna stop now <laughs> anyways guys uh thanks for watching my video hopefully this made some sense to you um please comment like and subscribe as always join members if you want more messages. We literally went through all the channel messages in this video. I guess you guys just needed to hear everything <laughs> for this reading for some reason. I just do what I feel guided to do. I said I'm doing more intuitive messages, so it is what it is, but we likely will do more members. I'll probably just do like random channeling, just see what else comes out because there's a lot of fun, interesting stuff right now. I don't know what this energy is. I'm still like laughing about something and I don't know what. <laughs> Anyways, um, and yeah, if you guys want to support my channel, uh, please consider looking into my deck. Also, I'm so sorry, you just saw my mess in the background there. Um, <laughs> cat toys. Anyways, but yeah, if you guys are interested, definitely look into these cards. I'm not kidding when I say, like, I love this deck. And it's not just because I made it. I actually feel like this is a very helpful deck if you're trying to get to the bottom of certain situations. Like, I swear, it just covers everything so well. Um, so yeah, I would definitely check it out. It's on Etsy and there's multiple listings. I'm going to put a, dis a description box. I'm going to put a link in the description box for a discount code for you guys to use. So if you're watching this long, congrats, you get the discount code. Um, I will put it down there. And then also if you're a member, I will give you a slightly higher discount code. I will put that in members for you guys just to say thank you. Um, but yeah, I really appreciate you all, and there's lots of other decks too, if you don't like this one, I have a ton of different ones, um, yeah, definitely check it out in the link below, if you purchase through the link, I also get, like, a little bonus, it helps me with the Etsy fees, so thank you so much to everyone who does, and yeah, I will see you guys in the next one, and if you're interested in this deck too, it is also on Etsy, once again, highly recommend, like, this is not my deck, but I wish I created it, it's an amazing deck, I love it so much, and specifically, like, these cars. <laughs> okay, bye guys, thank you.